let's go with it. All right. Okay. Oh, so we no. can explain a little. These are yeah. part of the. Yeah. So these, these are the controllers, game parts. So what's going on uh, right now? I am initializing the controllers so that they can sync with the control hub, which yet again I said is the the brains of the the robot, which is which sits down here. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah. this this device here is the extension hub of the control hub. So it's also it also acts as the brains of the the robot. Once we write the code here mm -hmm. and save, it responds to the expansion hub right here. All right. There are three things that are communicating with one another. Okay. We've got that. Is that yeah. the, the main brain is here there? Yeah, the main brain is here. Is so here. once we write the code here, we feed it to this, which is the main brain. Okay. All right. And the, then in you your have part. stuff in And there. then these these are, I would say, the hands okay. of the robot. So Who like the moves. Those? Did you purchase it already made? Mm -hmm. And this one already made? Okay, so this, what you see here, is uh, a kit, first global kit, that comes in, or already packaged. So it's under Rev Robotics, and all these parts come in the kit, all of them. So it's not like we purchase these separately, but they just, they all come uh, holistic. What as a work kit. did you guys do then? If this already comes as packaged, mm -hmm. what work then that people should appreciate? You guys are genius. Okay, okay, so what I mean to say is that these come not assembled. Okay. So these parts, right, we have to assemble them. All these just come as the wheels separately and uh, these uh, extension, these uh, extrusions, rather, they're not fit together. So these had to be put together, right? And we had to have 3D designs that would uh, help us to guide or to guide us on how we can have the schematics on how the boat is built. Mm. Yeah, so the coding? The coding. Okay, so for the coding, we worked together. So we had different teams. We had the drive team, the coding team, uh, the engineers, and we all worked together to bring this to life. Because like I said, these parts were separate and they are in a kit. So the kit, is, it's more of like you have, um, let's say, how, yeah. Well, like, it's like you're at the junkyard, yeah? Yeah. Where you have yeah. Uh, dismembered parts of a car, and then someone just picks them up and, and puts makes them it together. Up. Yeah. This is how you came up with this. Yes. Exactly. Okay, now, now. All right. I feel better. Okay, so. <laughs> okay, let's go with it. So this All is right. cooler now, trying to move. Yeah, uh -huh. so. Okay. With these, the controls and the instructions that are given in the robot, this moves a cooler forward. Right, mm -hmm. then this one moves a cooler. So it's a 360 degrees kind of guy. Yeah, it can it can move 360. That's for turning. Then we can move forward, we can move backwards. Then the turning, we can turn left, we can turn right, and yeah, we can explain the intake and the. Oh, the intake. Okay, so okay. Let me let me turn it the other way so that you can see it. So right here, this perhaps I can come closer. So this is where the bow comes in, right? Then the bow enters here and it's channeled towards this. So once the bow sits here, it's after the bows were left in Greece at the time. Okay. So we would have demonstrated but we don't have them right now. So once that is done, the linear slides can do that. They go upwards. So with the bow sitting here, right? The linear slides go upwards. Can take it more. Okay, let's take it down again. We we'll missed that down. one. Let's take it down. All right. Yeah. Okay. okay, so yet again the bowls come in here, uh -huh. then the bowl is sitting here, it's uh -huh. channeled within this. Great. Then the linear slides, oh, and they go uh -huh. upwards. So we have a nexus go here with different bowls and under there is a food. Okay, so once the bowls are dropped, then the food That's is nice. released using this. So let me, let me do this so that you can mm -hmm. see. Yeah, so once that is done, we have can just see the server again. Oh yeah, yeah. the server. Yeah, okay. so the bow is released into the next Yeah. Yeah, then we drop it down and practically more. That's it. Great. Yeah. So number 83, what a bad idea. Mm -hmm. I think with all those superpowers that you've mentioned, 
and then this product being explained in that order, I think we are getting somewhere. All right. What What's the future like? What do you guys plan on? Because if these are going to just be prototypes like this, then we're not going anywhere. It's time we stepped up the game to ensure that we create something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Any yeah, no. plans to work on something that's going to be there tangible? Yeah, um, we plan on doing that, like working on something tangible that can help maybe in the agriculture sector, or maybe uh, the food, the job that we have right now in Zambia. We would really love to work on that as Zambian Robotics, the youth of the country, you know, the bright minds of the country, um, working on such and we need support from different stakeholders you know yes all right so to add on to you know what she said maybe let's get to just okay. cola mm -hmm. what w what is needed to actualize this guy a cola uh i think overall we would need funding right because we are in the you know, 21st century and things come to life when there is funding involved. For us to even have this, we had sponsors. Mm -hmm. And uh, the thing is, the sponsors that we had were not local sponsors. We had to you know, get sponsors from uh, outside, the country. outside the country. So if we could have local sponsors that are willing to you know, help us to actualize you know, this design, uh, to help in the food industry, because remember the whole idea is feeding the future, and that's the design of this board. So, food, energy, and water. So, if we actualize this and you know had a more complete design and a, a well and improved design, right? That in a sense would you know help the country and help us to basically have this established. You guys are genius. Please continue representing the country. 183 countries, 83 position for Zambia. It's not a bad idea. It's a good start. I'm sure next year we can even do better mm -hmm. than what we did. Yeah. So check us out on the Zambian Genius Facebook page and please continue following that particular one. You miss it on TV, catch it on our YouTube channel, The Zambian Genius.